This is just really fascinating. We're in the field of architecture and design and just discovering a, a, a historical site on, on the site in itself is really interesting. The protocol in which they take is, I think, fascinating. It's a very unique part of the job and you don't get to see it every day. And you? Yeah, so our office is just a few blocks away and I bike past this almost every morning and we were wondering why construction stopped and I actually had the thought, like, I wonder if they're going to be finding things. They're digging up in Old Town. I wonder if they're going to find anything. And this is like the mother load yeah. of finding something really amazing and interesting. And we were thinking how cool it is that it was right around the time when the country was being founded. And there's so many important things happening in history. So we're very interested to see this story as it unfolds. Yes. We're beginning to take bets as to what happened, how the ship <laughs> sunk. So we'll see in the coming days what happens. <laughs> That's right. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get a cup of coffee out of it. <laughs> that might be wrong. <laughs> what do you think happened? How do you think it got buried so deep? Well, <laughs> you want to tell them? Your no, my theory is a bit of a joke. But uh, <laughs> what if it, the ship was invaded by people who are here before us? You never know. And I was saying, like, I think you need cannonballs, more likely. Like, I don't know that Native Americans had that technology. But I mean, we'll see. it could have just been something that was over full there could have been a storm and then I just learned from a news article we read that they were filling in they actually filled in part of the river to help with developing Alexandria so I mean it could have any number of reasons for sinking but we're in for a good story I know I, that. hopefully it'll be high drama and it'll add to all of the other good stories we already have about the history here Right, so I'm actually an Alexandria, Virginian local, and I think it's fascinating that they've discovered something like this box where I live, so it's quite neat that they've uncovered this bit of history and that you get to come down here and peek at it through these, uh, these tarps. Well, you know, this whole area was water. Yeah, they and they, it in. the waterfront was different. And so what they did is when they filled in the land, mm -hmm. you know, they can't put in dirt, and so yeah. they scuttled a bunch of ships, and they filled in around those ships, yeah. and that's how they built up the land, and they huh. changed the shoreline. Now that plot of dirt over there, that's not part of it, is it? 